what is going on you savages welcome back to the channel and welcome back to more wwe 2k game coverage and today we are talking about something that could very well affect a lot of the superstars that we see in next year's game and the years after that now before we get into all the latest i do want to remind you guys that to subscribe to the channel and turn on those notifications if you want to be fully up to date on everything regarding wwe 2k games so of course wwe 2k19 we are already covering countdowns and and the little bits of news speculations and prediction that we have gotten so far so again to keep up to date on all those content make sure to subscribe to the channel nonetheless i'm moving into today's coverage and this report is coming from tnc as they're reporting that randy orange tattoo artist is suing wwe and 2k games for using their design, for using it obviously specifically in the game. The tattoo artist is claiming that they use her designs without permission. Catherine Alexander, a tattoo artist from Illinois, who says she's been tattooing Randy Orton going back to 2003, she is of course also claiming that she owns the copyrights to the designs, which of course means that this is a copyright infringement issue. As the artist claims, she raised the issue with WWE in 2003 and was offered $450 for the rights to use the design, which she said that she declined the offer. As for the tattoos in question, she states that she gave Randy Orton a tribal tattoo on his upper back, as well as a full sleeve with everything from a Bible verse, skulls, rose, and so on. The TMC article also indicates how this is not the first time that 2K faces this type of issue, as LeBron James tattoo artist ended up so 2k games last year making a similar claim so this is a very common situation right now that it could affect many other superstars that have tattoo in the game now we've seen this before where wwe games ended up changing certain designs for certain superstars tattoos simply because they didn't have the right to use it so think of this as a domino effect imagine if more artists start to come out indicating that they own certain designs they are gonna be wanting a paycheck and in the end 2k games and other gaming company gonna be making tattoo designs that are similar to it so that they could avoid all of these issues another thing to keep in mind is that it is not 2009 anymore and wwe games is even bigger than what it was before just like the wwe continues to grow so these tattoo artists are definitely gonna be wanting more money at a faster rate so without a doubt expect a lot of changes when it comes to these tattoo designs in upcoming wwe games anyways you savages that is what i got for you on this video coverage i hope that you found this informative if you did i'll go drop a like on this video don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on those notifications to be fully up to date on anything that i post in regards to wwe news and rumors and of course a wwe 2k games coverage a lot of content for wwe 2k19 incoming so stay tuned we in the road to 100 000 subscribers i'm to see how dig it